Welcome back to Absolute Chat. Today I'm going to be reviewing the new, well, Channel 4 series of Dead Pixels, which is a comedy based on three mates playing online gaming and just the adventures of fun and the antics about work life and gaming online. So yeah, it's a, I think it's a very good series, but what Channel 4 have done, which I think is brilliant, is they released the whole series on on their platform. You can binge watch it, or you can watch each episode every week, so you've got choices, which I think is a really good idea, because after the first episode, you want to watch the rest of them. <laughs> so it gives you an opportunity, or you can just persevere and, and watch each episode every week, six episodes in six weeks. So I think it's a really good start and it's worth doing that. <clears throat> it's worth waiting a week for, but it's, if you, you know, binge watch, it's brilliant. But anyway, on to the series. It's, as I say, it's based on mainly three main stars. You've got Alex Davis, who plays Meg, Will Merrick, who plays Nikki, and then you've got um, Sargon Yalda, who plays the American gamer. So... Mm-hmm. So Meg and Nikki actually live in the same place, like, the, like a flat share kind of thing. And in the UK, of course. But what I like about this series is is the humour is very modern, very like Father Teddish kind of humour, if you like that kind of humour. It's got, you know, bad language and coarse words and stuff like that, but it adds to the it adds to the humour. I think it's a brilliant British series and Alexa Davis who plays Meg she was in Mamma Mia played the young Rose and she is absolutely fantastic in the part uh, it's so believable you believe that is her real life <laughs> it's, and just the laugh she comes out with it is it's brilliant it's it is good very good and then you've got Will Merrick and Nikki who actually actually lives in the, in the same property just in the next room um, which is a spoiler because you don't find out till I think end episode one or episode two. But anyway, I've spoiled it for you there. He's he is absolutely he's brilliant as well. He's he's oh I can't he reminds me of a character from the series Game On. You know, he, he's very naive, I mean he's very stuck in the game world. He can't he can't really live in the real world. He's just he's, he just lives for gaming. And when you see the clips where that work um, they're still chatting to each other with, with a headset and she's playing the game at work and the chat to each other so it's like constant gaming and Sargon Yelda, the American one is uh, the US man is he called um, he hasn't got, really got a name he's brilliant, he's got a wife and kid and he just sits on the sofa playing the games and he's got a wife and a kid in the background shouting and he's just there going ah, I'll do it later kind of thing um, you do meet his wife in it, and uh, he's, he's just brilliant. And then you've got another character who <laughs> who works with Meg. Um, is Russell, played by David... Oh, did I pronounce it? Mummy? Mummeni? 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 I don't know. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. But he is, just, he plays like the typical dumb gamer who just doesn't get it. <laughs> Literally, doesn't get it. <laughs> He's in the game and he just doesn't get it. He's just running around and doing silly things, but he manages to, to add the fun, fun humor element to it. Absolutely brilliant. Um, yeah, I've got to give this series nine out of ten. It's it's one of those things you can watch again and again and pick bits up you missed before. And I don't want to spoil it by saying in the episodes, but when they do the cosplay, I just think that is blooming hilarious. So hilarious. So yeah. Have you seen it? If you haven't, is it something you'll be interested to watch? Because if so, you will, you will, you know, don't miss out on it. Trust me. And um, just one of those things where you want to get your mates over, have a few drinks, and just watch it and just piss yourself laughing. Okay, well that's this. That's out for this podcast, really. I'll see you next time, and just hope you had a good Easter. By the time this comes out, it'll be. And called him Easter Monday, so yeah, unless it was on YouTube, it's a week later. That's where it's going to be, that's where it's going to be. Anyway, two little pips for now, we'll catch you next week.